Hey everyone, K0LWC here. If you haven't already, subscribe to the channel for more great ham radio videos. Today we're talking about the Anytone D868 and how to add a talk group without actually hooking it up to a computer. Yes, you can add a talk group just from the keypad. Here's how you do it. So we're at the main screen here. This could be a hotspot that you have programmed in for a zone. Uh, this could be a local repeater, doesn't matter. But here's the starting screen that you should have. So from there, let's go ahead and click on menu. All right, in the main menu, let's select the first option, contacts. Go ahead and click on select. All right, from there, let's go ahead and choose uh, option number two where it says new contact. And under new contact, let's do number one, input ID first. Now this is where most people get tripped up on how to add a talk group in. By default, the Anytone will show private ID. What that means is you're trying to do a private conversation from one radio ID to another. Think of it like a private message or a private email. You don't want that. You're trying to connect to a public talk group uh, where multiple people can hear you. So to change this, go ahead and click on the pound or hash symbol down here on your keypad. You'll notice this now has changed to group ID. That is what you want when entering a talk group for your list. Make sure it says group ID. So let's go ahead and add in 3112 as our talk group. Once you've added in the talk group number, go ahead and click on confirm. From there, let's do option number two, input name. Go ahead and click on select. From here, uh, we're, this is the Denver talk group, so I'm going to go ahead and pop in Denver for the name of the contact in the list. So D-E-N-V-E-R. All right, so once you have your talk group named, go ahead and click on Confirm. That's all you need to enter. Nothing else matters. You can scroll down and click on Save, number eight. All right, that contact is now saved. So let's back out and we're back to our main radio menu screen here as if you were on your local repeater or maybe on a hotspot. So let's go ahead and click the shortcut and let's click on list. You could also go in here and do contacts. Contact list is one way to do it, but you have a shortcut key here in the lower right corner for list. And there we have it, Denver as the talk group. So again, if I wanted to key this up, I'm gonna select it in the list Scroll down to number three, go ahead and click on select. It says contact selected, and I go ahead and key the radio. And now you see I'm keying 3112 Denver as the talk group. Also notice it does say group call at the bottom. That's also very important. You want it to say group call, remember that. You do not want it to say private. If your contact says private call down here, you have not entered it correctly. Make sure it says group call. There it is. That's as easy as it gets for adding a talk group on the fly from the keypad. If you have any questions, drop me a comment down below and don't forget, smash that subscribe button for more ham radio videos. Catch you again next time.